Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Freely Bird and welcome to another episode of WWE Supercard. So, um, my King of the Ring finished today, guys, and I really don't want to talk about it because I got fucked. Uh, I already claim rewards. I got a legendary Bruno San Martino. Um, something funny actually happened. I wish I could show it to you. I wish I would have screenshotted it or something. But, uh, basically what happened, I lost game one. Uh, I won game two. And then I could have won game three, but I was at work and I activated my boost and I forgot. I don't know why I did it. I forgot to activate my speed and charisma boost and uh, it, the game was tied 1-1 and the last matchup was the tag and our tags were pretty even, but I would have won the matchup. Um, and the last matchup was a speed charisma game. So I lost that, which fucking sucks. Uh, that's two straight King of the Rings where I've got destroyed. But I'm going to start one tomorrow, and I am, uh, I'm going to fucking win it. Um, I need more Survivor cards so I can get these Survivor Pros, and it is pissing me off. But also, guys, I thought I would share with you, um, my beautiful wife is sitting right next to me. Say hi, hi. Sabrina. Hi. She's not in the best of moods, uh, while I was at work today, my daughter was... Not the best companion. She was being bad. Right, Sabrina? She's just frustrated and wants to take a shower and do her lady things. And I want to go to bed. Bed. I want to watch Dexter and go to bed. Yeah, that is our... I don't know if anyone has seen the show Dexter. And please don't be a dick and post spoilers down in the fucking comments below. Because I will possibly murder you in your sleep. But, uh, Dexter, it's on Netflix, it's like eight seasons, but it is like one of the best shows I have ever seen, um, obviously it does not top Breaking Bad, as that is my favorite show of all time, I fucking love that show, I could rewatch it and rewatch it, but Sabrina doesn't like rewatching stuff, but, uh, yeah, that's usually our plan, I get home from work and dinner and family stuff, and then... After her daughter goes to bed, we watch Dexter. But, um, guys, the Ring Domination game mode starts tomorrow, and we all really do not know how this game mode works. And it's weird how they haven't, like, given us, like, the full explanation on how it works. Um, it uses your top 10 cards, no Divas, which is weird. And, um, I'm kind of excited for it. I'm gonna pro. I mean,. Um, I don't know how it works. I don't, they don't have title bouts. Like, I don't think they have title bouts. They might have, like, double shard bouts. I think that's what they are probably going to be. Because, um, I know you can buy bouts. Because the bout system is implemented in this game mode like it is for, uh, RTG. But, uh, I'm guessing that they're going to have double shard bouts. Um, and whatever it is, I'm going to spend 1,200 credits to get it. And sorry, guys, I had to transition chairs because my wife went upstairs. And I just want to sit in a nice, comfortable chair. But, um, I'm just hoping to get a good card out of this. It would be even awesome if I could get a pro. Uh, that would be sweet. And, um, yeah, I just want to do well in this first game mode basically what it is for me and alrighty and I'm gonna lose because of a fucking pro bad news bear damn it still after my first Wrestlemania pro guys uh, I don't know I can't seem to pull a fucking Wrestlemania card or survivor card for the life of me off the board right now I'm at like uh, 390 not 390 resets it's like 370 resets somewhere around there so I'm fucking pissed and also guys my survivor fusion ended today uh i did get a blasty so now i got two blasties for rtg i'm probably gonna keep both of them but um the plan is to use john cena for survivor fusion and roman reigns for survivor fusion i mean for wrestlemania fusion that is the plan but unfortunately guys i only have one fucking epic and i need two so i'm pissed but Getting that legendary for, uh, that legendary Bruno Sherry Martino, that really helps me, um, 
for these WrestleMania fusions. So after I get another fucking epic, uh, I'm going to be able to start my WrestleMania fusion. I don't know when I'm going to pull it. I'm going to try to play a little bit more Supercard this weekend than I usually do. Obviously, with the new game mode, uh, I'm going to play a lot more than I usually do. But I'm just going to try to get back into the swing of things. And I have a lot of training to catch up on. And that's the one thing that's kicking my ass. I really need to get going on this training. But, um, I mean, when real, when the real world uh, gets in the way of things, I can't drop everything I'm doing and play Supercard. That's why I kind of like a game like Soul Hunters. Because I can use my stamina and do what I need to do. And then, like, get off the game. But with a super card, like, it's a grindy type of game mode. Um, and I don't mind the game mode, but... I don't mind the game, but uh, sometimes you just gotta take a break. But I really need to get this training done with. Um, when I get that Bray Wyatt done, that'll be a big relief. And then I can work on Seth Rollins. And by the time I get both of them done, I'll have another Survivor Pro, most likely. Which will be another one. I really want to get Bray Wyatt done because he is a really good Survivor Pro. And that will help my Ring of Domination deck. That will help my RTG deck. That will help my King of the Ring deck. That will help my Exhibition deck. It's going to help all the way around. Um, so yeah, that is the plan. Um, my Ring Domination deck is not looking the best. I will show you guys one more time what it looks like. Um, I have like four or five WrestleMania singles in it which is shitty um i have well see my press my survivor pro ryback it's better than um it's better than wrestlemania singles but it's not better than an rtg single bret hart which is weird i don't fucking understand that but i'm gonna see if putting both blasties in actually helps my deck rating like it does an RTG so let's see here and I don't know if it does like I really can't tell the difference like I don't see a difference in my deck rating really I don't I don't understand it but that's probably gonna be my ring domination deck guys um from the looks of things, you want to have air when you do your deck rating. Um, it wants to have errors that are aligned with each other. So, for my bottom two, I have Bad News Baird and King Booker. Uh, a down error and an up error, so they're compatible. And then for my other two errors, I have Dean Ambrose and Ryback. Um, they're not compatible, but they're, they're like neutral. Um, and then I have uh, Daniel Bryan and Triple H. They're compatible. Uh, and then the rest are right arrows. So that might hurt me in the long run since they're not really compatible. But let's just... Let's hope not. Let's hope we have good luck with this game mode. Um, like I said, it's all a mystery. But I'm glad they put something new in the game. So they're trying. Gotta give them credit for that. Um... And yeah, and we did not get the proc. Fuck. Alrighty, so power. There we go. There we go. There we go. Whoa. So we will win this one. Boom, take him out. Trip. Trips. So I think payback. Not payback. What the hell? I'm too freaking pay per views back. Uh, I think the new pay per view. Um. What's it called? What the fuck? Battlegrounds. It's kind of a newer pay-per-view. I think it debuted two years ago or last year. One of the two. But, um... I'm not really caught up on WWE for this uh, pay-per-view. Um, usually I'm pretty in line with the storylines. I know we got Bray Wyatt and Rumor Reigns uh, feuding. Um, I don't know where that's going to go. Uh, Roman Reigns is probably... Roman Reigns is probably going to lose the first match and then win at uh, SummerSlam. That's my uh, prediction for that. And then we have Seth Rollins and Brock Lesnar for the championship. Um, I don't think there's any way that Seth Rollins wins. So that's probably going to be the end of his reign as champion, which is sad. But uh, I think he's just going to stay away from the title hunt for a while. 
Um, some people were saying a, a face turn. Um, it would be weird to see him face because he's honestly a really good heel. But who knows? Um, also, there's a rumored rat matchup of Seth Rollins versus Triple H at SummerSlam. Uh, I could definitely see that matchup happening. Uh, that's probably what it's going to honestly be because a lot of these dirt sheets, uh, when you get them from the right sources, a lot of them are right. And, um, yeah. Uh, so that's about that. It or that. Um, we're just going to play for this reset, guys, and then I will let you all go. Tomorrow will be an exciting video, though. It will be Friday, which is even more awesome. Of course, everyone loves Friday. Um, for you kids that are out of school, every day is a Friday to you right now for the summer. So enjoy it up while you can because you'll be like me working five days a week and uh, it sucks working in the summer. Let me just tell you that. <laughs> um, but uh, let's see here. And we will finally know what the how ring domination works. I'll be at work all day as well, which sucks. But uh, I'll get some like early morning game time in. I'll play some of my breaks play some on my lunch it might sneak a couple games in here or there i think that's what i'm gonna try to do um as it's friday and our workload isn't really big at work but uh guys we did get our reset we got a rare room and reigns and now we're just gonna train up this bray wyatt so what is he at 27 out of 45 let's try to get him fully Let's try to get him at least pro by the end of the weekend. That is my plan. That is my goal. Obviously, goals don't always happen. We don't always get the goals, but fuck it. Alrighty. So let's see here. Also got to record a Soul Hunters video after this, and my phone battery is not looking too hot. Yeah, it's a 22%. And Soul Hunters destroys my battery, as well as Supercard. Soul Hunters really takes a hurting on it. So hopefully I can get some good footage out of that game. For the little bit of time that I have. Alrighty, let's just do our commons. Might bring him up one more level. Might. Might bring him up one more level. Let's hope. Come on, bitch. Don't give me that fucking waiting on network air. Oh, it did. I didn't think it would. That's awesome. Bray Wyatt is level 32. Sweet, sweet, sweet. And I still have that fucking single Stardust. I've had that, boy. I've had that forever. Oh, that's killing me. Let's start with single Rock. I've had that since WrestleMania tiers announced. Jesus Christ, I just want to look. I still have single Yokozuna. Really hoping I get him pro here soon. And just singles everywhere. Well, I have that. Oh, my. My, my, my. A lot of training to do, guys. But thank you all for watching, guys. Uh... Yeah, guys, Ring Domination starts tomorrow. Awesome, 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 awesome video coming tomorrow. You guys do not want to miss it. But, um, guys, thank you all for watching. Drop a like on the video. I'd really appreciate it. Subscribe. I would love that as well, guys. And I am Filthy Bird, guys, and I am out of here. I will see you all later. Goodbye. Have a good day. Uh-huh.